Look, my royal subjects, and I mean all of you, because soon you will all bow down and worship my greatness. Because I, King Julian, am leaving my own magnificent kingdom and coming to you. But wait, this is no way for my royal adventure to begin. Maurice, roll back. Take it to when my wonderful brain had the idea to give myself to the entire world. Aha! Yeah! Remember these incredible freaks? Yes! It is the giants from New York! Ah, uh, who could forget them? And please, tell me because I have been trying to forget. Anyway, it all started there when they decided to leave their sad and pitiful home and set sail on a great adventure to find me. That's right. King Julian, look, I am so handsome! Right away, Mr. Alex developed a taste for the great outdoors. And for scaring off the stinky pooses, which was alright by me. But since the giant freaks loved me so much, I decided it was selfish to just stay here in my wonderful kingdom. I, King Julian, being only one of me, would share my magnificence with all of you and it would all start with little Mr. Alex. Wake up, Mr. Alex. Wakey, wakey, eggs and steaky. Oh no, I'm having that dream again. Ah, this is no dream, my friend. King Julian is alive and well and taking pictures for our new brochure, Madagascar. Why not give King Julian your vacation money? Yeah, sure, sounds great. But I need to catch some shut-eye before the big trip back to New York. No, no shut-eyes. Now run, jump, do whatever I tell you to do if you want to make the cover. Okay, so the very first picture I want is that. What? Oh, there we go. Nice. You are getting good at this, Mr. Butterfly Catcher. Yes, yes, move it. Way to go, Alex. Melman, where did you come from? And how did you get on top of that boulder? None of these questions have anything to do with pictures I want to take, so I suggest you stop talking and we move on. Hey, can I come with you guys? I have some... <laughs> yes, yes, that is the spirit mailman. Now let us proceed forward. Come here, run like a gazelle who's being chased by a gazelle. Come this way! Okay, fine. Pretty please, with steak sauce on top. Now, you must get ready to grab these very handsome King Julian coins scattered throughout the island. Besides just the general warm feeling that wealth gives you, these coins can be used to buy merchandise at the duty-free shop. How do I get to the duty-free? I'll show you later. Now double jump to grab this coin and hurry! Show me what you've got, like this. I'm a lady, I'm so hot. Now which one of you is attracted to me because I'm so beautiful? Uh, we don't have our day here. The lens has needs too. Do you have something against the double jump? Because it has nothing against you. Try again. The camera loves you! Everyone else loves me, but the camera loves you. Follow me, Alex! While that water may look beautiful and alluring, you would be wise to look and not touch. How many cats do you know that can swim in deep water, Alex? You silly kitty. You are not meant for such aquatic adventures. Please, sir, uh, stick to shallow water or just steer clear of it altogether. Yes, yes, you have my blessing. What in the name of Schnur are you thinking? 
you cannot swim in water this way i do not have all day to wait for limp along lion not do it Whoa, Marty! You've got some serious wheels there. You don't know this, but I've been scoffing down carrots day and night, crunch, 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 in an effort to develop a super fast sprint ability. Go ahead, buddy. Clock me. Oh, you're pretty fast, Marty, but I bet you can't catch me. Come on now, Mort. Ain't no way a little squirt can outrun a thoroughbred like me. Many things about Mort do not make sense, and one is that he can run like the wind. Why don't you two give us a spectacular race? Go. Ready? Set. Oh, this is too exciting. Go. Congratulations! I knew Mort would lose. Now the winner gets to kick his favorite soccer ball. Hey! Quiet, you. So, Marty, some of my careless lever subjects found the royal stash of balloons and are now stuck floating in the air like tops. Will you please pop the balloons and rescue them? Bonus balloon! Oh, I can't believe you actually did it! Bonus balloon. <laughs> oh, happy accident! Thank you, Mr. Marty. You are my hero. Nice job, Marty. Now stand back and watch how it's supposed to be done. What are you trying to say, Alex? I ain't got no game. No, I'm saying that you don't have any game. Okay, okay. You angry giants can trash speak on the soccer field, but now I need some more photos of Alex. Come this way. My royal rocks! Put them down, fancy chickens! Please, scare those cuckoo birds away from my beloved rocks! Now! Mr. Alex, you must save my rocks! And they are worth their weight in rocks! Ha! I did it! Birds be gone! Birds be back! If you save all my rocks, I might send the down. Okay, what? Anyone? Oh, Mr. Alex, your reward for chasing away the birdies is a fantastic ride on a zip vine. Jump up high and really hang on, or you'll fall off and land on your behind. You're not getting the hang of it. Oh, I know. Why don't you try holding on this time?
Oops, you jumped off way too soon, Mr. Alex. Dust yourself off and get right back on the bike. You're not getting the hang of it. Oh, I know. Why don't you try holding on this time? You did very well. But unfortunately, you're not a hippo. I need photos of Miss Gloria now. I will find her, then meet you at the soccer field. Wish me happy hippo hunting. Oh, Gloria! It is good to see that you can now swim. Too bad you are not as fast as I am. You? A lemur? Swimming in a lake? I find that hard to believe. Well, I find it hard to believe that you find it hard to believe. And you're right, I have a boat. Are you ready? What about Sam? Go! Yes, yes, move it! Well, clearly I must be dreaming since you're beating me. When I wake up, I will show you the secret diving board. The reward for out swimming. Uh-oh. A boulder is now blocking the top of the walkway. Why do these things keep happening? How about I grab that pepper and break through the boulder to clear the path? Hey, that is an excellent idea that I came up with. Very good, Bustick. I can guarantee that boulder did not see it coming. Follow me. I know where I am going. You found it good for you and good for me for guiding you. You want me to jump really high so you can snap a picture, right? Yes, yes! As high as the tips of your friend Melvin's pointy ears or the moon, whichever comes first. Not as impressive as I can die, but because I am here. Now swim with me this Oh, Miss Gloria, I have just been made aware of a very strange and ridiculous situation. Have you seen your friend Mailman? Uh, isn't that Mailman hanging from the ledge? Mailman! Oh, thank goodness you are here! We need you and your heli-gliding abilities! It is a matter of utmost importance! Utmost importance? Are you sure you want me for the job? 
Yes, as you can see, many of my royal subjects are currently floating in mid-air when they really should be on the ground licking my toes. We need you to glide around and rescue them. Press the jump button to glide your way over to each demon. Pick up every one of these demons. Better to capture a heroic moment on film rather than humiliation. Hit the bonus balloon! Bonus balloon! Melvin, you saved their lives! Now let us move on and never speak of floating lemurs again. Okay, now follow me, mailman. Everyone is waiting for you. Okay, now follow me, mailman. Everyone is waiting for you. Marty, this is your last warning. You'll never be able to score a goal with me in the box. That's why they used to call me the wall. Who? Who used to call you the wall? You never even played soccer. You were calling it land foosball five minutes ago. It's the same basic principle, Marty. You kick the ball, you block the ball, you spin around in somersaults. Guys, guys, please. As far as I'm concerned, you're both full of it. So why don't you stop talking and play? Look, you mess with me, and you make a mess. Ha-ha! <laughs> Can't touch this! Not my day! Nice try, Marty. And I mean that as a friend, not someone who's beaten your butt. Give it up before you get hurt and I win anyway. Know what you're looking at? A wall. That's right, I'm a wall. Well, the kind of wall that has a great personality. Look, you mess with me. And you make a mess. Ha <laughs> ha! Can't touch this! Not my dad! Nice try, Marty. And I mean that as a friend, not someone who's beaten your butt. You're quite good, Mr. Marty. But now I want to play a full game of soccer. I will pick a teammate that will even things out. Mort! Sure, bring it on, little man. Tell us how to play. And just to show you how confident we are, I'll barely listen. Well, I won't even give you an explanation then. Thanks to all who helped make this brochure. Now one last picture of us and it's off to the printer. Well, that covers everything on the agenda. Right, Maurice? Sir, don't we have to load the plane, fly the giants home and have all sorts of misadventures? This always happens when I don't write things down. <laughs>